Hello there people from YouTube, how you doing? Hope you're alright, I'm Alex, welcome or welcome back to my channel. And today I have to say that I'm super excited because today, like not long ago honestly, uh, Stan Walker released a new song and it's my first ever release since I started following him on YouTube and on his career in general and I'm so excited and now I have a feeling that this is going to be the first ever song that I've list I will listen from him uh song in only Maori language because the the past ones that I've listened to were also uh in English and I'm super excited because I love how the language sounds and all and I'm 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 seriously excited. I saw it on YouTube that he posted it as program video, and I was like, "Oh my god, is it going to? It's going to be my first ever release since I I follow him." So I, I was super excited. Like I couldn't wait for this day to come, and I've seen uh, that he programmed this video like three days ago. So I've been waiting for this since the beginning of the week. Basically. And for those of you who don't know, I'm Italian. I am on a musical journey on this channel so uh if you're a stan walker fan maybe if you want to recommend something please do it in the comments or if you want to recommend uh artists from whatever genre it doesn't matter uh you can leave it in the comments also let's keep this short so without further ado let's get to the video um just for your information i checked on youtube and subtitles were not available so um, since I'm pretty sure that it's going to be only in Maori, uh, I will try to look for the lyrics online, but honestly, I just want to enjoy the music and just want to enjoy his voice, the song in general. Uh, so please forgive me if I don't look up the lyrics and the translation, uh, right now while I'm listening to it. I just want to, uh, enjoy it fully. Oh, hey. Oh, no filter studios. Like I didn't say in the last video, I did with him one of his songs that I enjoy a lot. The moments in the studios. Uh, this first part of the video was just magical <laughs> without music, without nothing, just his voice. That's so amazing. Oh, that was so nice. I like shots where he's like in the booth singing with the phone, like reading sometimes the lyrics probably, but I just love to see those moments of artists just like recording the song and what, what happens uh in the in the backstage backstage we can say. So basically behind the soundproof window and how the producers um, work on the song while he records the voice and it's just amazing i just love those type of videos and his voice is so good and i just really love this vibe honestly <laughs> So good. I love the background voices. I love the the 
chorus behind his voice. And I think, all in all, between all the artists that I've listened to so far, Stan is probably one of my favorite. His music just doesn't, just leaves you speechless. And it's amazing every single time you listen to one of his songs. Oh, uh, uh, I love his tattoo. The tattoo he has on the on the head and all the way down to his back. And I, if I remember correctly, there's some part also here on the forehead. Like I don't want to mis to get it wrong, but I don't remember exactly. But I'm pretty sure he has some the uh, the continuation here of the arrow because I remember watching his fir uh, his first video. Um, where he had everything showing, didn't have the hat on. And I remember uh, saying that he reminds me of the character from The Last Airbender uh, that has also uh, the arrow on the forehead. And they they really look alike. Uh, yeah, I remember. But that 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 too he has there, it's really cool. I don't know if it has a meaning. It probably does. Unfortunately, what people know about Maori culture is just tattoos most of the times. Like, you see people going around uh, with Maori tattoos. But I don't know if they do it just because they like it or if it means something for them. But I'm pretty sure that people from Maori tribes have tattoos that mean something. So maybe the tattoo he has there means something. Um, I know that the one on his neck uh, is the name of his daughter. Because you, you told me because I was curious about it. If you know the tattoo he has on his head and all down the spine, uh, all down his back means something, please let me know. <laughs> It's so good. The trumpets. This song gives me the vibe of a mix between a pop song and a gospel choir song. So that that is amazing. I just I love gospel choir. By the way, I've I've been to gospel uh, concerts and they're always amazing always mind-blowing and like they give me chills every single time every time i, I go to uh, a gospel concert uh the feeling is there and it, this song gives me a lot um vibe of gospel and pop <laughs> well I don't know if it's normal, but the feeling that I'm getting right now is like I want to cry. <laughs> I don't know, like I don't know if I'm, I'm. It doesn't 
feel like a sad song because it, it the rhythm the 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 melody that's not a sad melody i don't even think the words are sad but the the feeling that it gives me makes me feel so like i don't know my, my heart my soul just feels the meaning behind the words even if i have no idea what it's saying and i just i just want to tear up i just felt it building in the eye i felt the tears building in my eyes Oh, I have cheese. Wow. I, I'm so, I'm, I'm, I'm still super excited for this song. It was amazing. My first ever release uh, from Stan Walker. And I was not disappointed. I loved every single second of it. And I know it sounds stupid because that's what I say every single time I listen to something. But if I when I when I start to like an artist, I usually start to listen to every song they have. But it's rare for me to not like in something they do. Um, for example, uh, I'm a Swifty, and there's very like few songs that I don't usually listen from her. Um, that are like oh, skip. There are very few, so uh, I generally like every song from the artists that I follow that I like. And I know it sounds stupid every single time I make a video, but if they are so good, it's hard to find something that is not good. So I'm really happy uh, I got to listen to this song. I'm really happy he released it. And I, like I said, I have no idea what this song was about, but I, my soul felt it. And I felt like some weight lifting out of my shoulder. And that's probably why uh, my tears started to build. And I felt at peace for the entire time, like five minutes. And it was the best five minutes of this day so far. Um, so, yeah, it made me feel like really good. My brain feels better, like less heavy, less worried. For some reason, this song gave me a peace of mind, peace of body, peace of whatever. I'm just feeling at peace right now, but that's probably the Stan Walker effect because every single time I listen to one of his songs, I feel like that. And it's a feeling that I will never trade for anything else in the world. Because, like, Stan is that artist that I go to when I want to relax, feel better, and win wind down. You know, like, uh, w when a day has been hard or I just need to feel at peace. His vibes, the music that he has, his, like, just the way he acts when I watch his videos and all. Just give me that peace of mind that I need to just, you know, calm down and say, even if it was a bad day, tomorrow is going to be better. So that's the Stan Walker effect for me. And also, um, I've been talking about Stan a lot with uh, people. And um, since I'm, cur I'm curious, I, like, I just like Maori culture, okay? So I wanted to know if if you are from a Maori tribe please let me know in the comments like can you become a part of a Maori tribe like do you have like what do you do what do you have to do to become a part of a Maori tribe like do you have to marry someone that is already part of a Maori tribe or do you have like challenges uh you challenge people to do uh, stuff and they if they pass the challenges you um you just adopt him in in the tribe or i don't know like i'm just really really curious how it works or you just like you just you're you're just born in a maori tribe but I, I don't know how it works and i'm super curious about it so if you are from a maori tribe because like maybe every maori tribe uh, all over new zealand have uh 
different uh, type of inclusion. I don't know, like uh, different uh, different ways of admitting new members, or maybe they don't, or you just become a member by marrying someone, or maybe another tribe can work differently. Um, so yeah, let me know from what Maori tribe you're from, and if you have this, uh, if you admit people that are not Maori in 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 the tribe because i'm super curious like i want to be a part of a maori tribe just like but it's a secret and no one else needs to know it's just like being between me and you <laughs> uh so yeah like it will be nice to know that's it for today's video it was amazing i love this song i love stan i love his music and uh, yeah i can't wait to listen to more from him and getting to know him more uh also like i said i will check uh, the lyrics for this video um, online as soon as I can. If you're new to the channel, consider to subscribe. Give this video a like if you enjoy it. Thank you for sticking with me so far. And if you came this far in the video, let me the emoji of your favorite animal down in the comments. Thank you again. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.